This is an instructional video using the Safina Venipack system. Here I wanted to demonstrate a very focused video on using the pullback to take branches. I like this technique because the branch stays in view the whole time. So it's just a bunch of clips of using the pullback technique on large branches, medium sized branches. And uh, there you can see one right there. Just going across the branch and cauterizing slowly a few times with the Pac-Man technique. I advance towards the crux and then just pull the slider back quickly. Uh, occasionally I just have to push a little bit of adventitia off it and then keep going. Here's a very large branch that's moving away from me which is usually difficult to take. And here I just cauterize until I don't see any more spray and move forward just a little bit, cauterize again, I don't see any spray and then when I feel comfortable I just pull back and it cuts the branch. And you can see it's got a nice seal. Here I'm using the pullback. I start somewhere around the middle of the longer blades and then move forward just a little bit and then when I'm at the crux I just do a pullback real quick on the slider and then I'm done and keep going. Sometimes there's a little bit of adventitia you know that I didn't get to when I did my dissection because you want to just do a little bit of dissection before you do this. Just the tip. Don't clean off that whole branch. Here I probably did more dissection than I had to, but I made a little window, moved forward with the pack band, pulled back, and you're ready to go. Good seal, no bleeding. Here's a pullback on the anterior branch. Move forward on it. I did it a couple times and then a quick pullback. And then I'm clearing, I'm clearing the adventitia out of the way and then move, move, moving on. Here's a branch that I did the, the pullback. Oh, this is a medial branch. This is a big branch. I do the pullback after I see no more spray during my cautery. There's just a little bit of tissue still there and sometimes I just do a quick forward motion as I'm cauterizing and then I'm done. Always keeping the branch in view. Here's an anterior branch that I had uh, cauterized once and here's a second pullback on that. Here's a second pullback. Sometimes you can just do a second pullback, one move forward. Here I did a little rotation, then pulled back, and that took care of the branch. Here's another large branch. And this is actually a new user. This is someone that hasn't taken vein before, only done a couple cases. And she really likes the pullback as a preferred method. It's a little bit easier for her to do, having no experience. Uh, with EVH or the device. And again, you can push through that adventitia. Here's another branch taken by a new user. She made a tiny window. She's very good not to do over dissection. She cauterizes until she doesn't see any more spray. Advances forward just a little bit and does a pullback. And that branch is cut. And here's another branch by a new user using the pullback. It's a little bit simpler to use this uh, to use in terms of a technique to take the branches when you're first learning and the branch stays in front of you at all times. Here she does her Pac-Man. She moves forward then does the pullback and the branch is cut and sealed. 